Hey, it's Brad here from surfed.com and today I'm reviewing the Rios Floating Sunglasses by Hairs Edition. Check these bad boys out. So obviously I was intrigued when I first heard that you could get floating sunglasses, genuinely floating sunglasses, not some kind of gimmick. I've owned waterproof sunglasses in the past, ones that were designed specifically for surfing and they didn't really last very well. These are quite a different story. Now Rios have actually been generating quite a lot of buzz amongst the water sports community. They're big when it comes to kite surfing, fishing, surfing, you name it. If it's on the water, their sunglasses are built for purpose. Now, I've used these in a number of different ways. Obviously, down at the beach, playing with my daughter, I've used them whilst recording water footage with my underwater housing. I found them to be really useful. I would have preferred to have had a little strap, something I probably will get. There is a hole, so you can attach a strap and make sure that you don't lose them, although nothing is guaranteed as waves start to get bigger and bigger and bigger. However, at least if you lose them in the water, they will float just like my favorite surf hat, the Rip Curl Wetty, which has a floating brim. This product will float. So as long as the cable tie at the back is not too heavy, you'll be able to find them again if you are surfing somewhere that's not ridiculous. So what do I like about these sunglasses? This particular model is named after Bahia Salinas, which is a popular kite surfing location in Costa Rica. It's a sports frame, it's unisex, men and women, 100% UV protection, polarized, anti-scratch, anti-fog, and anti-glare. Now, I haven't actively tried to test out whether they're anti-scratch or not, but I did get them covered in sand, and I literally just gave these a rinse under the tap, and a little polish, a little buff, and they're perfect. I'm really happy with these sunglasses. I don't know what you think. How am I, how am I looking? Let's take a look closer. What I really love about the Rios brand is that you can tell products are engineered for water sports enthusiasts. There is padding on the arms, there is a little bit of padding just on the bridge of the nose. In these places where without padding they may get a little uncomfortable, especially if you use them in the water. As a surfer, would I really use these sunglasses in the ocean? Yeah, absolutely. I took them out for a surf in two foot waves i didn't have a strap and they were absolutely fine if you're interested in finding out more check out riosgear.com r-h-e-o-s gear g-e-a-r.com there are loads of different models that you can try out including a range for kids so if you're training one of your favorite groms to be a surfer kite surfer whatever it might be even a fisherman well maybe it's worthwhile just protecting their eyes. I wish I'd had access to something like this a lot earlier on in my life. In terms of unboxing, the sunglasses arrived in a really nice secure little box, robust box, some information about caring for the sunglasses, just rinse with water, fresh water after salt water or chlorine exposure, and avoid exposing to extreme heat. A little brochure mentioning that they are part of the 1% for the Planet program, and a pouch so that you can keep your glasses safe and sound and ready for action. Together with my floating surf hat, my new Rios floating sunglasses are a key part of my surf gear kit for 2020. I encourage you to check them out.